Hey guys, okay, so it is October 1st and I've decided that I'm going to do Vlogtober. So this is day one and it is 5.08 p.m. already. I'm about to touch up my hair a little bit and then I'm going to go to the store and look for a few things and y'all are gonna come with me. So I'll see y'all in just a sec. lazy girl hi lazy girl what are you doing is your daddy giving you snuggles she doesn't look very comfy like that hi baby bye cuties I'll be back soon okay I love you. So of course it's raining, so I need to go get my rain jacket. And I'm gonna leave y'all in here. So one sec. Okay, so I have my rain jacket on now and I am really hot because here in Puerto Rico, it does not get cooler in the fall. I hope that y'all are having some fall weather. Comment down below if you are. I'm so jealous. Um, I wish that we were having fall weather, but we're not. It's still hot. And I wish that I would have woken up this morning knowing that I was going to do Vlogtober, Vlogoween, whatever. And um, I would have like taking y'all to the mall with me because I went to the mall earlier and I went and where else did I go? I went somewhere else. I don't remember but I went a few different places and then it just would have been fun to bring y'all with me because I did all that by myself because Caleb was working this afternoon even though it's Saturday he still had to work so that would have been more fun if I had y'all with me, but now that I know that I'm doing this, um, it's gonna be fun. I like vlogging, so. Yay! Okay, we're already at the store. That's how close I live to it. So I'm just going to look for a parking spot and then go inside. You want me to send you pictures instead of just telling you what they have? Okay. Love you too. Bye. Okay, I have to show you all this. This is the best. This pumpkin pancake and waffle mix is so good. It was the last one here, so I'm definitely getting this. And now I have to send Caleb some pictures of the chips that they have here. Okay, I'm gonna do a little haul here in the car. It's getting dark, so I'm gonna try to do this fast. So I got some treats for bowser and cola these are their favorites and we just ran out so i got them more of those i got two little whisks i needed these so bad because um i don't have a metal whisk like this i do but it's actually an attachment for a like handheld mixer that i have so i've been using a stupid like handheld mixer attachment so i decided to finally get one of these I got Caleb his chips. He wanted some sea salt and vinegar chips. So those are for Caleb. I got all of my makeup that I did in high school. Um, this is the powder that I wore. I got some cute little puppy band-aids because I just thought they were cute and I felt kind of bad for them. <laughs> um, I got some of the blush I wore in high school the mascara I wore in high school, the concealer I wore in high school, I can't believe they still have all this stuff, and the eyeshadow quad I wore in high school. I got something for a swap that I'm doing. Um, I got some of these little Yankee Candle melt things for my Scentsy. I got two in Autumn Wreath, and I got one in Spiced Pumpkin. And then I got a Butter London nail polish. This is the shade La Moss. I don't know. This is really pretty, like dark maroon color. Really looking forward to wearing that. Can't show y'all that item because it's for Sammy for our swap. 
And then I told y'all about this. It is the pumpkin waffle and pancake mix. We went through this size tub in two days. So those are really good. Um, so that's all I got. I also got two boxes um, to send stuff in the mail. And that's it. And I also went to Starbucks and I got a hot chocolate. I asked them if they had the caramel apple spice and they said no. So that's disappointing. So I'm just gonna drink a hot chocolate. I didn't feel like getting a, a pumpkin spice latte because those are so bad for you. So, I mean, hot chocolate's probably not any better at all, but I decided to get a hot chocolate just because I was already in line. So when they told me that they didn't have caramel apple spice, I wasn't just gonna leave. So I got this and let's see if he spelled my name right. Julian, what is that? What does that say? Julian, J-U-L-I-A-N? I don't know. I always spell it for them because I know that it can be t tough to like guess how somebody's name is spelled or if you don't like hear the way that they say it that was my little shopping trip and now i have to go to the gas station because caleb asked for a mountain dew and a coke after i had already left so i'm gonna go to the gas station get coke and mountain dew and then go home so i will see y'all at home hi hi bowser Hi, I got you new bones. I got you new bones. <laughs> have you had a good day? I love you. Can I have a hug? Wait, no. Good girl. Hi. She's my baby. Okay, so I have been planning on showing y'all a lot of pumpkin recipes, but my kitchen is really hard to film in. So I'm just gonna incorporate each of them into these Vlogoween episodes. So the first one I'm going to show y'all is this healthy pumpkin spice coffee-free drink. It's really good. I've made it a few different times. So all you need for this is vanilla almond milk. You can either get sweetened or unsweetened. I like it sweetened. It is healthier if you do the unsweetened version. Ground cinnamon, pure pumpkin, maple syrup, and you can also use sugar-free maple syrup or the calorie-free maple syrup that Walden Farms makes, and some Co-Whip. You will need two and a half cups of vanilla almond milk. Two tablespoons of pumpkin. Two tablespoons of maple syrup. And one fourth of a teaspoon of cinnamon. So now I'm going to use my new whisk and just mix it all together. And sometimes I add a little bit more syrup or a little bit more pumpkin um, just to kind of give it a little bit more flavor. As it heats up, the flavor kind of goes away. Um, like when I taste it cold, it tastes better than when it's warm. So sometimes I'll add a little bit more syrup or a little bit more pumpkin. It's just like how you like it. So it's really easy and it's pretty healthy and it's coffee free. And um, probably all of these ingredients together cost less than one pumpkin spice latte and you can make a lot of these with all these ingredients. So once you have it in there, 
just get some whipped cream, Cool Whip, and add it on top. I like to finish it off with a little bit of cinnamon. Are y'all jealous? Do y'all want some of this? Do y'all want some of this? Y'all are acting very jealous. I'm going to dip the pumpkin chocolate chip cookies I made earlier in this. Let's see how it tastes. Basically just tastes like whipped cream. When Cola wants something, she kisses me. <laughs> if you try out this recipe, let me know. And tell me how much extra stuff you added because you really do have to keep adding stuff as it gets hotter because the flavors will kind of cook out. So I probably added another tablespoon of pumpkin and another tablespoon of syrup. So, and that recipe only makes one serving. So if you want to make it for two, like I did, I had to make two servings. So that was two servings and yay. All right guys, that's going to be it for today's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you're excited about Vlogtober and I will see y'all tomorrow. So be sure you're subscribed to catch all of my Vlogtober videos. Bye.